Welcome back, unicorns, to another video. In today's video is another Face Plus Friday video. So if you want to see what mask I use today and hear all the information, stay tuned. So this week, me and Lori, um, Lori Latimer, such a fantastic, if you don't know, um, we're doing a mask together. And we decided to go with the theme, use a mask we had open. So this is one I'm using. It's the Spa Scriptions exfoliating gently gel wash off mask with kiwi and watermelon and it's 15 minutes and i did i already put my skin off camera since i used this before and i try to use uh, the rest of the packet because i used already i wanted to use the rest of the packet because before it goes bad so we decided to do that theme so let me know if you like that theme um and make sure you go check out Lori's channel to see what mask she's using that she has open um and i'm so excited about next month we're going to be doing a valentine's theme mask with you know cute things like that and i'm so excited about that month and hope you all do enjoy it uh let me know if you tried this mask before in the comments down below it's by spa descriptions they came in a pack of like i think it was like seven or eight let me know if you tried it before let me know your thoughts let me know if you enjoyed this video or face my surprise by giving it a thumbs up i really do appreciate it it really does help out my videos pushing them out there to anybody that hasn't watched me yet and you know it helps with the algorithm and stuff so please do that when you have time so while this mask is on for the rest of my times as i did do a little bit before camera i got on camera um i'm gonna do some empties since it is the last Feb friday of the month um so i'm gonna show my empties for the month um some have a little bit plotted in it but they gone bad so i'll talk about that when I get to them and then all the rest of them are empty so let's talk about them so let's talk about my empties i always put them in a bag like this because i don't have nothing to put them in um and i try to do this monthly when i can when i get enough products so let's talk about the first item on top this is the one i just used up in today's shower and sorry about it, it's a little messy there is shampoo or something on it um but as the Cetaphil Cooling Relief Body Wash for all skin types, refreshing and revives skin and body with this cooling effect, which I really love. And it um, helps with 24-hour dryness relief, um, advanced moisturized blend with blend with a eucalyptus, I don't know if I'm saying that right. And it's for um, skin sensitivity five signs. So I got this from Influence and I've been using it up and it's been in my shower for a while. That's why it's a little messy. Um, I love using this during the wintertime, which is during this month. It's very hydrating to the skin. It's very cooling and the smell kind of reminds me of that stuff you put on your chest when you're sick. So I think this is a great one if you're sick as well. I love doing it when I'm like congested and stuff like that. I like washing my body and smelling that when I'm in the shower. Um, and this seems like a really good um body wash i really loved it so sad to see it go and I, an influencer gave it to me for free for review and i'm giving my honest opinion um it is fragrance free it's sulfate free it's paraben free where the scent is the eucalyptus so it's very nice for the winter time and very hydrating and another thing i like using this with because of the thickness that it has um is a shave gel or shave cream it works as good as that i use it um, in the shower today i think it works very well because most of the time when i have um used shaving creams like that's meant for that i usually get cut and sometimes when i exfoliate and then shave like they say i still get cut so i try to stick with like soaps because i feel like i don't get cut that way and they still seem to shave very well so i still use it that way but yeah so that's all I have to say about that one. If you want to see the video of me unboxing it, I'll try to link it during this video or just check out my um, influencer playlist and find it that way. Um, if I forget to link it, sometimes I do, sometimes I forget to link things. But I'll try to if I remember. Um, and I just love that I got that size body wash for free. And it's a very nice one. So, yeah, that's all I have to say about that one. Let's get on with the next ones. So the next ones I put in here just now, um, when I was looking through it, because I was trying to find a mask that I wanted to do it and that I had open, and I decided to throw these out because they are very, I think they've been open too long. So the first one is by Freeman's Jelly Mask Plus Cleanser, and it's very hard in the package, 
The other one is Too Faced as the Clay Mask. It's um, cucumber and pink salt. I was going to use this one today, but it was dried out. And then I got the Gel Pilling Unique Diamond Mask. I just thought I'd throw this one out because um, I've had them over for a while. And I think you're supposed to use them after, like, you know, a couple days after you already used it. But I had them setting in my um, little collection that have open masks. And this one seemed like the only one that was good, so I decided to use it today. So, yeah, these were great. Um, the Freeman Up the Lemon mask, it was very hydrating to the skin. It did smell like lemon. It was very nice. I love that it's a two-in-one mask. The clay mask was like a pink clay, and it was very hydrating to the skin, um, even though it's a clay mask. Um, and it's supposed to detox and clear pores, and it's only a 10 minute mask, and it was very nice. And this one's like a gel pilling, like, um, exfoliator type thing. And we used that together, me and Lori. And, yeah, I had it for open for a while. So it's very dried out now. But that's why I have to talk about those. If you want to see the videos on those, just check out my playlist for Face Mask Friday. They're in there. Um, so you know. So let's get on to the next thing that I have here. So... This item right here is from Wet n Wild. It's the Leap Lip Scrub in Watermelon. I had this for a while now. Um, it's starting, it kind of smells like watermelon and um, like it's going bad a little bit because I had it for a while. It's like very hard now, so I decided to throw this out. Some, I always forget to use the lip scrub. I've been trying in the new year to do a scrub a lot more to help my skin out and my lips since it is the winter time. But that was very nice. It's watermelony. It's um, cruelty free. It's vegan. It's very makes my lips feel very soft. I really love the watermelon scent. But that one needs to go because it's been in my collection for a while. It's very hard, so I threw that out. And I'll link all this product I'm talking about down below. The just links to get there if you want to get it for yourself. Um, so and just let me know in the comments if you do go get it and let me know your thoughts on it or if you tried any of these products. I love to hear your thoughts on it. And also, give me a thumbs up if you like empties as well. If you um, haven't given me a thumbs up yet, I really appreciate it. So the next thing I have is a lip balm by LA Colors. And this is one I got from Sammy Rose here on YouTube. I'll link her channel down below. She is such a sweet lady. She gave me this in friend mail. And when I start getting close to that plastic that's holding the lip balm, um, I tried to throw it out because it starts rubbing against my lips. I don't like that feeling. But this one's LA Colors and it's, I did not know they had lip balm, but this one was in cotton candy and it has a little raccoon on it. It's so cute. And the other one I got was a cat and I think those were really cute. And if you don't know Sammy Rose, she is another YouTuber. Um, I think she still does YouTube. I haven't saw any notifications in a while, but she does like Dollar Tree hauls, um, makeup, crafting, stuff like that. So if that's something you're into, make sure you go check out until I sent you. She would really appreciate it. Um, so yeah. So now the rest of my items are empties for the time being. Well, this one was empty. It just had a little bit of product in it. But all the rest of the items are empties and I'm going to talk about them now. Okay, the first thing I got is by Lit Bear. It's one of the little packets that have the um, stickers on it. I decided to throw away, um, and this was very nice. I really liked them. They're like little star acne patches, and they worked very well. If you want to see my review on it, it's on my channel. Go check it out. Show some love. Um, I did get this in PR, but I do give my honest opinion. They weren't really great. I still have um, others in my box, so it came with a box of, I think, 148. I think there's pa there's not that many patches in it. So this one was the first one I used up, so I put it in here to let, talk about it. The next thing I have is by Gulf Island Fat and MD. Um, it's the Doctor Scrub. Again, during this year, I'm trying to use scrubs more. Um, I use it once a week to help my skin out. But this one's the um, Ruby Crystals Microfiber um, Exfoliator, a daily face exfoliator that adds hydration and removes dead skin cells and review re revealing brighter radiance healthier looking skin and this was very nice i really love that the ingredients in there was not um like what do you call it like um big chunks on it and it was very gentle to the skin and didn't feel like harsh and I really did love it. And I got this from Ipsy in like an Ipsy glam bag. And it was very nice. So sad to see it go. And I heard a lot of great things about this brand. But I have other scrubs I need to use up. So I'm glad that I finally used up um, 
one of my scrubs. And I'm glad that I did that this year to try to use more scrubs because I feel like it made my skin very soft um, and look better with the scrub. So I'm trying to do that during the new year. So we got three more products to talk about. So the next thing I used up is the Dove Advanced Care um, Moisturizing with Natural Oils. And it's the pomegranate one. And this was very nice and it smelled nice. Um, and it's supposed to help, you know, with scents. I use the Dove. Sometimes I use the Secret one. Depends on what I get. And I really like it. It's 48 hours. It's, um, a deodorant. And I'm glad that I can use this without it breaking me out. Because when I was younger, Dove products used to break me out. They're like soaps. So I'm so glad that I could find a product from Dove that I can use. And it won't, like, break me out or anything. But this was very nice. Smelt nice. It lasted somewhat very well. Um. But, you know, I didn't go running or anything, so I can't really say if it helped with sweating or anything like that. So, the next thing I used up is by Youth. It's um, the Hydronic, Hydronic Acid Plus Vitamin C Triplide, triplide, or triplide I don't know if I'm saying that right, 31. It's the Powerful Sermon Targets the Sign of Aging, Collagen Loss, Damage from Free Radicals, Fine Lines, Wrinkles, and Dark Spots. So, this was very nice and very hydrating to the skin. I got this in a giveaway when um, it's in a glass bottle and it's in a dark one. I just kept it in the box because that's what I do. I don't know why I do it. But I just keep it in the box, um, but it's in a glass bottle. And how, um, this is very good to the skin. It felt like it moisturized, or not moisturized, hydrated my skin very well. It didn't have a strong scent. Um, it absorbed well. It didn't like take a long time to absorb into the skin. And I won't know the, like, just you know the i won't notice a difference or something because i don't really have aging skin but you know they say you know start young with aging products so this one was very nice i love that it wasn't scented or anything and it has a pump so it's easy to um get out and yeah so that's all i have to talk about that one um if i remember i will link the video of the unboxing if you want to see what all i got it was a whole kit which i was so grateful for and yeah. So, and let me know if you did, if you do, you, um, heard of this brand before. They have some good stuff. I tried some in the past. I was so excited to win that giveaway to try more. They are on Amazon, but they do have their own website. And they have some really good skincare items. I really love them and enjoy using them. And I'm so excited that I got to try this out. And it was very nice. I love products that don't have, like, strong scents. And if they do have a scent, I want it to be, like, kind of like the ingredients, not, like, perfumey. So this one was very nice to try out so we got one more product left so the last product i have is um another pr item i got it's by himish i don't know if i'm saying that right it's the artless glow base sps 50 um it did give you a, your skin a um very hydrating look like a glowy look and i really did enjoy this i always use this under my makeup i sometimes use it by itself but mainly under makeup because I like the hydrating look it gave my foundation and I really did enjoy it. Um, it did have a scent, but it wasn't strong and it did not smell like sunscreen, which I really enjoy. I don't like when sunscreens have that sunscreen scent for my face. I don't mind it on my body, but on my face it seems too strong. So this one just had like a pleasant smell to it. I don't know what exactly it is, but, um, and it has helps with, um, anti-wrinkles brightening it's uv uv protection and i really like that and yeah that's why i use under makeup a lot um because it says base so that's why i would use the last of my skincare routine and then sometimes i'll put a primer on but i really did enjoy this brand um they gave me some other items as well um from their collection and i still have one more item from them which is the cleansing bob that one gives me a takes me a while to use up but I really didn't enjoy the products they gifted me and um hopefully soon or maybe in the future I could try more from them but it seems like a really good brand so I think that's all I have to talk about today let me know your thoughts down below if you tried any of these empties before or if there's something new that you might want to check out let me know in the comments also give me this thumb, thumb video a thumbs up if you did enjoy this video it really helps out a lot I know I'm saying that a lot but they say if you keep saying it, you can get more thumbs up that way. So please do that when you have time so it helps my videos get out there to people that haven't watched me yet and help with the algorithm. It really does help out a lot. So, 
yeah i think that is it so that's it for today's video if you enjoyed it give it a thumbs up comment down below if you enjoyed seeing this masking video and empties um and i tried this mask before so make i'll make sure to link it down below or it'll be up in the icons if you want to hear my thoughts on it but this one's a very nice mask i'm just gonna wash it off the camera but if you do want to hear my thoughts on it i will link that video down below or in the icons and lastly don't forget to subscribe to the unicorn family hit the bell icon to be notified when i upload and unicorns always be yourself bye